Welcome back, members of the Wolf Pack. It's your boy. And we are back with another episode of Rise of the Ronin. And so, uh, I've been running around. Obviously, see, I changed my outfit and stuff. I've been running around trying to get a bunch of stuff completed. I wound up getting all of, uh, what, did I, what did I get? All the pictures. So, I got that trophy for all the pictures. I got a trophy for, like, making somebody fall in love with you, basically. Bas and uh, I'm one cat away from this zone. Yeah, this zone. See, there's one. I'm missing one cat right there. I can't. It, it doesn't even pop up. So I'm assuming once I complete this quest, it'll be the trophy for the pictures. And then there's gonna be a, there's a trophy to complete everybody's side mission. But the thing about that is, I've done all the side missions right now. I'm assuming some more are gonna pop up. Um, because there's a bunch more that still haven't been done and I don't see anymore. Like, unless I missed some throughout the other chapters, which I did all the ones in the other chapters as well. I think you just have to get everybody's bond to a certain point in some of the chapters, or whatever, for it to get right. And I think that's what, probably what I was missing. But we'll see what happens. And uh, we're going to go ahead and start this new quest and go on with it. What the hell happened here? Looks like these men were still breathing pretty recently. This doesn't bode well for Katsura. We need to find him now. Yep, yeah, let's go. Okay, okay, let's go. Right. I'll start over there. So much of the town has been burned down. So many homes. Okay, We're meant to be fighting for a better country. I know this it seems like... anything but. I'm probably rushing through these these quests at, at times, but it's really not. Like this is just how the game plays. Like I'm at I'm at a good enough level that I can kill people a little quicker. Like right now I'm at level 48. I'll get a trophy at level 55, which I'm obviously I'm going for. I don't know how many more. Uh, Quests are left, but I definitely should be level 55 before uh, the game ends. For sure. Let's ask our friend here what that was about. Cutscene? Yeah, cutscene. Thank the stars. Glad it was you too who showed up. Katsura, I had a feeling that was you. What are you doing in that getter? The Choshu men feared the worst. I've been looking into the Shogunate's next moves, but I've let down my comrades by not being able to fight with them. Genzui, especially. It wasn't for nothing, though. I got my hands on some vital information. The Shogunate are going to send in a force to deal with Choshu soon. The Shogunate is making a move. Hmm. They're seizing their chance to take the Choshu out once and for all. Indeed. And they're expecting the Satsuma to provide the best part of the force. Them again? But weren't they planning to revolt against the government? Well, the Satsuma are making a show of compliance to the Shogunate, which will spell the end of the Choshu. Any bright ideas? Hmm. You know, I've always wondered why the Choshu and Satsuma don't just make an alliance. You're the only ones with enough power to bring about change in this country. If you joined forces, you'd be unstoppable. You're not wrong. It would be incredible. Could it be done? But the Satsuma and Choshu are sworn enemies. We cannot simply form an alliance. Sure you can. You can talk about it. That's right. While the Satsuma and Choshu fight, the West eats our country alive. Is that really what you want? Oh, I see what you're saying. Then we should ride to Kyomizadera Temple. Takamori Saiko of the Satsuma should be there at present. He's the commander of the Satsuma forces right now. If we can persuade him, this plan might have legs. Let's meet at Kyomizadera Temple! All right, let's get it. Oh, what? 
that was the end of that quest. All right, we'll 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 add another quest on to it because that that didn't even make sense. Like that was the end of that quest. That was probably like five minutes of that. Can I teleport up there? Can't teleport there. I don't get it. Oh, this one is actually this thing. I think I, I think okay. So this is probably how I unlock this because I tried to get up there to get this daggone thing. I could not get it. Like I I don't know what was going on. Like there was no path for me to get it. No way for me to get there. It's like you get all to the top and you can't get to it. So I'm assuming I, I had a feeling it was locked behind a quest. A lot of things when whenever you can't get to something, it's because it's locked behind a quest. Which I is one of the things about this open world game that I don't like. Is a, a lot of things will be locked behind a quest. Like a lot of pathways and things like that. Like, oh, no, you can't go do that. You can't unlock you can't do this fire mission, this firearms training, or you can't get that cat or this shrine and stuff because that building, access to that building is locked behind a quest. You have to do a main mission quest in order to get to that building. And it's like, this is supposed to be a free, this is a, this is a free roam game. Like, I'm, I should be able to free roam. I also think that somebody should create a game with graphics and stuff like this and that plays like this, but has the loot system of Skyrim. Of the El the Elder Scrolls game, and I know some people have done some mods to Elder Scrolls to make it look sort of like that. But thi this game with the loot system of, of uh, freaking uh, this type of game with the loot system of freaking uh, Elder Scrolls would go hard because it just makes you feel more realistic. Then I'm looting, I'm getting random stuff off the people, and they still got their clothes on. When if I loot this dude, I get exactly what he's wearing, and and that'll be the end of it. I was thinking a, 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 a remastered uh, Final Fantasy Tactics would go hard in the paint too. An enemy like me shows up out of nowhere. No problem. We'll handle this. So, Saigo's in this temple, right? Oh, oh Saigo. Right. The former chief priest of this place, Gesho, was said to be close with Saigo, and I hear today is the anniversary of his death. I was told by a geisha who was clients from Satsuma. Apparently, he met his end during the Ansai Purge, where he and Saiga were persecuted. See this? It won't be easy. But as long as you're sincere, and make him understand that's all in the best interest of the country, he'll come around. Alright, let's, let's do this. Okay. Time to head inside. Why, why did you just let me accept Ningo again? Come on, we'll man. Get let's, let's, if we let's just rush in. Better to wait for the right moment. The grounds are pretty big, so we should prioritize locating Saigo. Let's change our allies. I was looking at my ally thing too, and it's uh definitely need some more allies in this thing. I don't. We haven't had him yet for sure. The thing is, I haven't picked this chick to come on a mission with me, but she has been on a mission with me, and I don't know if that counts. Because like I said, cause I haven't picked her to go on a mission, but she has 100% been on a mission with me because uh, there was a certain mission that that called for her to be on it. I'm glad we can work together like this. My spear is at your disposal. All right, let's, let's do some things, baby. Okay, I see you. I see you over there. I didn't. I didn't see you for a second, but I see you now. I'm gonna go ahead and kill you. With me. Other guy, come up here. All over in a heartbeat. Damn it. They, they didn't throw a single blow. Not a single blow was thrown by my teammates. Not even an attempt to throw a blow. 
Same path I'm taking right now is the same path it let me take when I was uh when I was going up there. That's like I went all the way up here, did all this. You go this way, it's a ladder right here. Oh, now the ladder's not even down. Wow. At first the ladder was down, so you can just oh god damn it. First the ladder was down, so you could you could just jump on it and go up here. But I guess now there's a mission, they wanna put the ladder up. So you can take the other way around, which is this way. Cause then you gotta pull Ray yourself up here. Wow, I was not expecting that. I really appreciate it, partners. If y'all hit this dude so he's not hitting me, that would be great. Like y'all legit, he watched me kill his buddy and y'all watch him hit me. I thought I killed his buddy. Like we all just watched the whole thing happen. Nobody stopped anything, we just watching. Didn't mean to do that actually. To get assassinated, why your boys back here fighting is crazy. Like, you, you just didn't hit any of the fighting. Come on, Jujitsu guy, do something to him. I just noticed he's my first formidable foe. I probably missed one already. Boy, this quest is gonna be a little bit longer than I thought. And I honestly didn't mean to throw that thing at him that first time. I thought that was gonna uh, take me up top so I can do an assassination or something. Oh boy, yeah, he got me. Hey, what's up? know I'm gonna kill you which has always been one of my favorite parts about games like this as well it's uh like I mentioned before I love over leveling myself because I I truly want to enjoy the game I play these games so I can enjoy them not so I can struggle with stuff but this game is, is kind of ridiculous because even with me being over leveled you still struggle a little bit like one two Oh, 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 oh. That one dude is still over there in the corner. Still over in the corner and has no idea what's going on. Bruh. How oblivious can you be? Nanda. Yep, Nanda. What the fuck? That's no ordinary item. What the hell? Why, why didn't they, so <laughs> the, the ladder automatically go down? All right. So this is basically where I, where I was at. Now, now, I don't know where the hell to go because I was I was here. I'm assuming this is gonna now take me down and take me take me over there to the other way yeah this is gonna take me to the other way now at first you can go that way but it's blocked off like you, you can't go further damn it damn it i knew i was about to fall as soon as as soon as it happened i knew i was falling Oh, 
Oh, almost fell off again. Yeah, you can come this way, right? This is right here, for sure. I was like, okay, where do I go next? I try to jump on this and jump across this. Nah, it's a, it's a, it's a it just blocks your way. So we come over here, right? And, and wait a minute, is all these dudes part of this too? I think they are. I, I think maybe that's why I couldn't get up there. I think I was supposed to go up this way. That's probably why. I didn't even think to go down here and go all the way up here around here. I didn't think of that at all. I thought this was going to take me to a completely different area, so I didn't even go this way. Hmm. That's on me then. Because now, now it makes sense. It didn't, it didn't make sense at first. I thought it was a completely different area, but now it makes sense. Damn, bro. Yeah, both, both of y'all had to just go busting through the door after, after you seen me not bust through the door. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. Jesus. <coughs> why, why am I not aiming on this guy? Like, I already knew he was a... He was a formidable dude, but it wouldn't let me aim on him. Bruh, you're supposed to have no stamina. How how you get all that stamina back to do that attack? I don't know what is up with these dude swords do and why they always OP. Stop, stop aiming on a dude that's up on the tower. Y'all got one dude that I gotta kill. Y'all couldn't even kill one dude. Come on now. I couldn't, I couldn't jump off. I couldn't jump off. Because, of course, y'all are not killing him in time, so he's able to hit me on the ladder, which is crazy. How was he able to hit me on the ladder if y'all down here already? I knocked him down to y'all level. All y'all had to do is kill him. Instead, this man hits me on the ladder. Tried jump away. He tried. He tried jump away. But you, you got hit by the game logics. Oh, this about to be long. How is it an enemy right there and he's right here? That doesn't make sense. Take your time. It's usually not like that. It's usually not another like enemy like that when if he's here because he's he's usually the end. Like he's like, all right, you about to finish the game. I mean, you about to finish the board. Is that all? Oops, uh, we're gonna, we gonna disassemble that. I mean, uh, disassemble that. Disassemble. Is that all? Cause I feel like there's gonna be some more guys around here too. Yep. Mm -hmm. 
Is that a dog? What's, what's over here? Nothing? Whoa, I thought I was gonna make that jump. So, you've been ordered to lead the expedition against Joshua. What do you intend to do, Psycho? What would get your advice from the Well, I'll leave you to ponder it. Some solitude may bring you clarity. Where's his dog at? He has, he has a dog. Oh my gosh. I'm trying to hit him with a stun and my partners are doing nothing as usual. Okay, whoa, I, I knew his bitch was gonna throw me off. Caught me with that. It's it's crazy how how strong he is. But it's simply because it's simply because my partner's just not really helping. Like it doesn't make any sense how how ass they are and he's probably still not dead because god forbid we kill anybody crossing blades with someone with no intention to kill is pointless exactly Said, exactly like to speak to me hmm. Satsuma never chose to begin this fight. That decision was the Shogunate's. Forget the Shogunate. I want to speak to you, not them. It was the Choshu who drew their swords first. And considering their behavior in Kyoto, how can we leave them be? Look, I understand Satsuma's perspective, mm. but... Have you thought about our future? What do you mean? Hmm. Yeah, I'm persuading this dude. Change this country? You, what are you saying? Saigo, deep down, I know you agree with me. There are things Satsuma can only accomplish with Choshu by its side. You want us to march alongside our sworn enemies? I simply cannot see it. And yet it can be so. If we should will it. But first, I should apologize. I am sorry. 
I could not stop the conflict earlier. Katsura of the Choshu? What are you wearing? Oh, ignore these filthy rags. I assure you, my aspirations remain unsullied. As my associates have said, we must put aside our differences. Even if it means moving heaven and earth, we must transform Japan. Katsura, I... I hear you. I accept your proposal. Hmm. Gesho, too, would have been glad to put an end to the bloodshed. Then it's settled. The Choshu and Sasuma will join forces. And we shall be the ones to see it through. You know, I've heard that in the West you're meant to hold hands and shake them on occasions like this. Go on. Try it. Yeah, it's crazy because that's, that's still not a, a huge concept in Japan. Just shaking Second hands. One. I look forward to working with you. Pleasure is mine. I thought this would be the crap out of his dog. So persuaded uh Tiger Psycho. Okay. Which how wouldn't we have persuaded him? There was no option to really kill him. Alright, that that disadvantage the timeline. Swayed by Ryoma. Defies the Shogun's orders. It's a good thing I did all the quests around there. Assault on the Choshu. This episode helps the Satsuma and Choshu draw closer, and they conclude an alliance aimed at overthrowing the Shogunate. <laughs> Don't you remember what I told you back then? That I had a dream. As big as the damn ocean! <laughs> this way. Jumping away, yeah, had to. It's just a scratch. Don't worry. <clears throat> he needs medical attention. <clears throat> Come on, let's go. I want to get back in the past for a start. Sounds like a plan. Ah, uh, this is a real mess. <laughs> After being attacked at the Terada Inn, Ryoma Sakamoto took refuge amongst the Satsuma clan. Might not be so lucky next time. I'm going to have to leave things to you for now. I'm counting on you. I mean, I've been the one doing everything. 
I, I like how the games always do stuff like that. Like, oh, now we need you to take the ball. Like, what, nigga? What do you think I've been doing? I've been, I've been running this thing since the beginning. He also looks like the captain from uh, Bleach. Stark, I think his name is. He looks like Stark. I think. No, no, not Stark. Stark is freaking which we call it. He's the Espada. He looks like the dude that became the uh, commander. Uh, with the one eye and the dual swords and stuff. <clears throat> Y'all know who I'm talking about. Oh, yeah, but another thing, like I said before, this game is confusing, too, because I have, if you look, we'll look at my bond, right? Let's see if anything... Oh, it's my protein drink. I said, what the ham sandwich is that? Oh, now that cat unlocked the firearm train, which is still not a lot, which means another mission probably did on that, my bus. All right. The end of Shogunite. We're about to end it. Um, Bonds. So if you see, right, my Ronin bond is at bond seven. It's almost completely up, but I have unlocked nothing before, which I don't even know how to unlock those things. Like, they just... How? How do I unlock them? Because they're not unlocking. Because the Shogunite one, everything's unlocked. And I'm at bond level five. So I got my complete, completely bonded with the Shogunite. The anti-Shogunite, even though I've done plenty of quests with them, nothing's unlocked. I don't know how that works. I don't know if I have to keep doing the anti-Shogunite quest and then it's eventually just going to unlock. Because I've done all the side missions. All I did for this was do the side missions and whatnot and then unlocked. I guess if I stop from time to time now, what will happen is a purple flag will pop up for a Sugar Knight quest and a uh, green flag will pop up for the anti Sugar Knight. And it'll, it'll randomly just pop up. So maybe I have to do a, a bunch more of them to get this bond level up and uh, it'll, come, it'll come from there. But yeah, that's, that's what's up with them. And obviously you see your boy changed the outfit like crazy. But uh, that's it for this. I guess we bought a work towards ending the Shogunite, which is crazy because I just helped the Shogun on two different quests. Like, right before I jumped into these quests, on two little side quests. But I guess we're going to end the Shogunite on the next quest, so hey, stick around for it, and I'll catch y'all in the next one.